Hey guys, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a AliExpress haul. So I ordered some abayas, I got one dress, um, I got like a little three pack of undercaps and one little magnetic pin to try out. I haven't opened any of my packages yet. Um, they're all just like sitting here um, except for the undercaps because I wanted to like try these out and use them a little bit and just like, tell you guys like my honest review about these if they're worth buying and um, yeah, so I've opened those and then everything else I haven't opened. I feel like I'm waiting on one more package, but I'm actually not sure. So I'm just going to film this now. And then if I have one more package coming in, when that comes in, I'll film myself opening that as well. But yeah, these have been sitting here for like a really long time. I just haven't had the chance to sit down and record this video until today. I'll first start off with the undercaps that I got. So they're like these undercaps, which I think are like kind of copies of the hot hijab, I think it is. Or is I think it's Hot Hijab has these kind of undercaps and they sell them for like $50 or is it $25? I don't remember. Um, I'm pretty sure those ones are better quality, but these ones like they work really good. Okay, so I love two undercaps. I've tried ninja undercaps, but like it really bothers my neck and it like itches me so I don't like wearing those, but I love how like they give you full coverage and everything. And then tube undercaps, they have a little opening so your hair kind of sticks out, but with these undercaps, there's like no opening or anything and it's like scrunchy so if you have a lot of hair, it'll like fit in there, it like stretches in this area. It also like adjusts right here so you can tie it to as tight as you want it, like based on your head shape, because not everyone has the same head shape, you know, and it's very comfortable. They don't slip as much. These are my favorite undercaps by far, like these are it, these are my undercaps that I'm always gonna get now I'm honestly gonna order some more I got like the white color this nude color and then I also have the black one and I also like how this white one isn't like super see-through I got this white one from Aliexpress um like a while back and it was actually like very see-through of a white undercap this one's not like super like thick but it's not like that see-through like it looks kind on and everything so yeah I got these colors I haven't worn the white one I usually don't go for white undercaps as much but I like having them just in case but I have worn this one a couple times and I've also washed this one and even after washing them, it's still really nice. I've washed this black one like about three times already um, and I wear it like almost every day so I'm for sure gonna order some more of these undercuff. I really really like them. I really recommend them you guys. They don't slip. I love how you can like adjust it and then it's just really comfortable and then I also know that like all my hair is good, secure, hidden because um, with like these Georgette Crepe jobs and like Chiffon hijabs, I feel like they're a little sheer. So when I would wear like a tube undercap, I would like pin it closed and I was just like really extra and sometimes it would like come undone and it was like really annoying. I really really like these undercaps. They're honestly my favorite undercaps I've ever tried and I feel like I'm only going to be wearing these now. I usually only wear like my tube ones when these ones are in the wash. So yeah, definitely recommend these. I'm really happy I decided to pick those up and they were like super inexpensive. I think they were like $4 each, which is super cheap for an undercap. Even like the tube ones I would get from like Veiled Collection, they were like 10 bucks. They're nice undercaps but they don't cover all my hair um so yeah definitely recommend these definitely try them out all right moving on i think i'll just open this little package which i'm pretty sure are the hijab pins i ordered let's see how they are i think i got black ones it's been so long since i placed this order um yeah i don't know i thought i would like open it on camera with y'all i just thought it'd be more interesting that way i don't know this is very like packaged up tightly wrapped up very secure I don't know why I don't have scissors with me right now, but I'm too lazy to go grab them, so I'm just gonna have to do it like this, I guess. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's just like a, you know when you open like a box and there's like a box inside of a box? This is very tightly packaged up. That was a lot of packaging for just this tiny little pin. It's in like a little baggie. So I got the black one like I thought. Looks like this. So that's gonna focus. It's like a matte black color. I thought I would get black because I like wearing a black hijab, so I thought it would blend in more seamlessly. Oh, seems pretty strong. Put it in right here. I'm not wearing a magnet right now, actually. Yeah, I like how, like, it's, like, it blends in because I like wearing a black hijab. I'm happy I got a black one. Um, I have, like, the gold one, which I realize, like, you, can, you can't really see it because I put it, like, from underneath, but I'm like, why didn't I get, like, the same color as my hijab so, like, it blends in more seamlessly, you know? Yeah, feels nice, tight. I mean, yeah, looks nice. It's, like, nice matte black color. It blends in really well with the black hijab. I think they had like white and like a also a like neutrally color. I just got one. I think it was super inexpensive. Yeah, I'll just leave that on for the rest of the video. I guess why not? Feels nice. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's gonna hold up. Like I don't think magnets lose their magnet over time, so I would um, give this a thumbs up. Moving on to the next package right here. Not sure if this is gonna be a dress or an abaya. Okay, so I got this dress right here. I feel like it looks a little different. 
for it or actually no i think this is exactly what it looked like feels nice quality and everything we're gonna have to see nice cute puff sleeve it's only lined love that it has like a cute floral pattern i actually really like this i think this is super cute for the summertime i'm not sure how it's gonna fit and if it's like long enough but looking good so far i didn't realize it had like little polka dots on it um, I'll zoom in so you guys can see that better. Like the little tiny polka dots right there. It's kind of like the same color so it blends in. So I feel like that's why it wasn't too noticeable. But super cute. Excited to try this on. Alright, this dress is um, not my size. I think I got a size smaller. Or I don't know if this was a one size dress. It has like this little scrunchy thing right here. That you can like scrunch if you could see that. Um, but this one is really long on me. I'm five foot five. Two, the fit of this is not right. Um, the shoulders kind of don't really line up as well. I feel like they should be like more over there. There we go, I guess. But yeah, it's very like, it looks like I'm wearing like three sizes up. I mean, I'm all for it. Like, I like loose dresses, but this dress isn't meant to fit like this. Like, I feel like the waist should have been cinched in and then get like looser kind of. But I don't want it super tight either. Um, you guys saw the reference picture of this dress. So you saw how it looked um, and I'll put it up again on the screen but yeah super big I think I'll just try to sell this um, if somebody is um, like a couple sizes bigger than me this might fit you really well it just doesn't fit me it's too big and also too long but it's a super cute dress so yeah I'm really sad about this one I had high expectations for this dress very loose and big on me so I'm gonna have to give this a thumbs down unfortunately the quality and stuff's fine though moving on the next package this one seems like a big one yeah um there was just one thing in that i did i have a feeling i have like one more package coming in somewhere but after opening it i'm wondering where my other packages are because it says it's delivered to me and it's not in here so i'm confused so i got the dress i got this one okay so this is the one i haven't received yet um it says i got it delivered so I'm so confused. It says April 22nd. Oh, okay. That's so weird. It literally says delivered. And then it says on the top, estimated delivery April 22nd. But I haven't gotten it yet. So I'm really confused. Okay, so whenever this one comes in, whenever that is, I will... I'll open that with you guys. Saying the one I was most excited about is not here yet. But that's okay. So I got this like green abaya. Oh, it has like a... I didn't notice that in the picture line, like a bedazzle little thing right there. It's cute. So it's just a green colored abaya. It's actually really cute. I like the green color a lot. It's like nice lightweight, feels good. I'll try that on and see what that's like on. This is what this one looks like. It's very thin, um, so it's nice for like summer, I feel like. And I like the green color of it. I didn't properly like do that or I need to iron it and stuff, but it's cute. I probably wear like a white shirt underneath it. Um, not this like pink colored one, but I like it. It's cute. It's like a nice lightweight abaya yeah that's what this one looks like um it looks a little weird under these pants because they have like this whole thing so it's like bulging out kind of and then it also has like a like the cut of it kind of like does that so it's like that if that makes sense so you can see that um but yeah just like a very nice lightweight i like the green color i feel like i should try this on with like something white or something like that so you guys can see it a little bit better the length is good on this as well super cute the stitching on this i'll show you guys close up so you guys can like judge yourself that's what the stitching looks like on this yeah i got this one right here which has like beads all throughout which it has all the beads i'm kind of scared about like what if the beads kind of fall off you know they look pretty like secure i would say and it's just a cream colored abaya with like beads on it super cute feels very nice and lightweight i'm not sure if this is going to be see-through ish i mean a little bit but not like an insane amount i mean i'm obviously going to wear like a, something underneath it but yeah it looks good so far super cute excited to try these on okay so this one is a little sheer but not like super duper sheer i mean i'm wearing these black pants i didn't change what i was wearing so i just threw it on top of whatever i had on earlier so i feel like this would be super cute with like a white dress underneath i really like the sleeve detail 
how it has like that and then it has like the pearls the pearls seem pretty secure i don't think they're gonna be falling off they're kind of let me show you guys put in like that so it doesn't look like they're like stitched in they're kind of like pushed in if that makes sense if, if i'm explaining that right so i feel like they won't fall off i feel like you'd have to hand wash this of course so yeah as you can see it's a little like sheer but it's not like insanely sheer and i feel like if i was wearing like a white pant a white shirt or like just like a nice long white dress and then this on top it would be really nice it is super duper cute has like the pearls i'll definitely update you guys on this if they like fall off or anything because i feel like this is a super cute abaya but yeah it's like a nice beigey color kind of like almost a yellowy tone to it super cute it fits me like at a good length i'm five foot five for reference so i guess i have one more package of three more abayas coming in i think let me double check for two more so I have two more bios coming in and that's it. I knew there was one more package. I was just like, maybe it's all in this one. Maybe I got it from the same seller. I was a little confused about that. Um, uh, yeah, I'm gonna check the mail because watch it be in the mail today. I didn't re realize that it said April 22nd on the top. It's April 20th as I'm filming this video. But yeah, I will um, check on that. As soon as I get that, I will record it or I will just share it with you guys on um, I'll probably open it and then just show, share with you guys what it looks like on. So I don't think I'm ever going to get these two abayas that I keep talking about in this video. I'll put a picture on the screen um, of what abayas. They're like closed abayas. I was really excited. They looked really cute. I did place this order back in February 18th of 2021. That's about like three months ago or two and a half months ago almost. I feel like I've given it enough time. It should have came by now. So I'm just going to post this video with the items that I have received. I guess I wouldn't really recommend the seller. But I did message her and she told me that the abayas say they were delivered to me but i'd never received them and so i just contacted usps asked them where my package is i guess because she said she sent it out and that it's delivered in my mailbox but i never received it so i don't really know what's happening with that um i'll probably get a refund though eventually if i just never received the package um but yeah i'm not gonna wait on that anymore because i really don't think it's gonna come it's been over three months or two and a half months that's more than enough time and all the other packages came in so i'm just gonna say that one's not coming in so i'm just gonna post this video as is for y'all so that was my aliexpress haul i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video don't forget to leave a like comment or subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye